And this sucker is coming down in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. y'all can hear it's pretty loud right now it's a lot going on and i'm going to show you guys what's going on in a minute but first i want to show you these um new pillow covers that i got more goodies for the living room <laughs> Alrighty. okay so these are from i want to show you Okay, so these are from a company called Dumbitis. I'm not sure if I'm saying that right. But shout out to them for sending me these pillow covers. I love a good pillow cover. It's a really good way to, um, you know, change the look. So I'm going to go ahead and open these up. All right. So first we're going to do these gray linen ones. Next up, let's do this one. I think this one is gonna be my favorite. Oh yes. This fabric is very, very, very popular right now. I think it's pronounced Bukale. I love this. Oh yes. This is super cute. Get into it. I love this. I love this. I'm probably gonna have to get another one. Ooh, that's cute. That's cute, right? That's real cute. Again, these are all 18 by 18 pillow covers. And last, this is the Another Bukele um, <clears throat> fabric, but this one has a pattern on it. Ooh, I like this. Very nice. It's an ivory and black. Look how nicely that pairs with this one. Oh, yes. It already looks nice with what I already have up here. Let me go ahead and get these, um, get some pillows inside of these, and we're going to come back and see what is given. Thank you again to this company for sending me these pillow covers. They are available on Amazon, you guys, and the link is in the description. You may have heard me mention a time or two about these lantern flies who have wreaked havoc on our backyard. One of the main issues it has caused is uh, the damage of this tree. So we had to do what we had to do. Okay, I'm kind of grossed out that I got to get close to it because I'm trying to see if you can see how the trunk of the tree is completely black. This is the work of lantern flies. It's regular going up. It's kind of hard to tell, but that is completely black. And you can see if I zoom in because I'm not going all the way over there. So, oh. Uh, Lantern flies, dead ones. It's a lantern fly graveyard. But this suck is coming down in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord.
Now, nobody wants to cut a tree, but we didn't kill it. The lantern flies did, but we have to be responsible neighbors and not wait for it to become a problem. We had to be proactive. Once again, if you are not familiar with lantern flies and the effects that they have and where they came from, feel free to do your own research. Really quickly, I want to say thank you for clicking on this video. If you are new here, welcome. I'm O on my channel. Primarily, I bring to you creative lifestyle, mom life, DIYs, home decor, home improvement. And if that sounds like your jam, hit the subscribe button on your way out. All right, so this is what we are left with. This gross black stump that is making my skin crawl, but um, they will be back in a few days to remove uh, what's left of it or as much as they can. Um, I'm not happy that the tree is gone, but I am happy that all the nuisances that came with it are gone, um, including this black sludge that's on the gate that came from the tree. It is also all over my car. It is also all over um, my husband's bike. But anyway, um, it just allows us to get ready for what's happening next in the yard. Uh, so tune in for that. Please don't forget to like 
comment, subscribe, and most importantly, ring my bell. Until next time, thanks for watching.